Hello and welcome to Celebrity Reporters. In this video, we will be looking at Mariah Carey's house versus Nicki Minaj's house. Without further ado, let's get started. Mariah Carey's house is one of a kind with the stately stone mansion presides over more than five acres of manicured grounds and sits regally with the pool, a grandiose, 90-foot-long violin-shaped flight of fancy that is the estate's most unconventional and attention-getting feature. Reportedly constructed at a cost of about $1 million, the 50,000-gallon pool is sheathed in almost half a million glass tiles with fiber-optic strands that light up for extra elegance. A spa serves as the violin's chin rest and two slender koi ponds stand in as the bow. The mansion offers a stylish foyer with a gracefully curved staircase and comfortably generous formal living and dining rooms, the former with a gleaming black marble fireplace. There's also a fully paneled library with lighted bookcases and a fireplace emblazoned with carved wood lionheads. Less formal but no less deluxe family quarters include a colossal gourmet kitchen, an adjoining breakfast room and a family room, the latter two with French doors to the backyard. Other notable creature comforts include a basement-level games room and media lounge with a 900-gallon saltwater fish tank, a light-filled fitness room and a home theater with wet bar. The five guest suites, two upstairs and three more on the main floor are joined by a star-worthy main floor master suite that comprises a private sitting room, spacious bedroom, a dressing area with extensive closets and, naturally, a spa-style bathroom large enough to comfortably accommodate the pop superstar's resident glam squad. There's also an outdoor kitchen, an outdoor shower, a fire pit and a sport court. Nicki Minaj is super open about who she is in her music and on social media with fans, but when it comes to the super personal aspects of her life, she remains a little more private. And where she lives is one of those things. Minaj lived in a huge mansion that sits on the former site of Frank Sinatra's home. It's a home in a very exclusive gated community. A luxurious home isn't just a well-designed or a well-arranged home. It's a place where its amenities enable the owner to feel overindulged. Just like Nikki's home, you can think of royalty and extravagance. There are many things that the word luxury can suggest. Think about pools, saunas, game rooms, and gyms. The features of a home make it luxurious or lavish. It can be its interior design or facilities. There's a massive kitchen with a huge breakfast, nook, two sinks, a fridge, freezer, and even a fireplace. The master suite has two bathrooms with a private terrace. There are seven bedrooms upstairs, and there's a guest house that can be accessed separately or from a balcony on the second floor with another two bedrooms and a shared bathroom downstairs. That makes it the perfect party house. The home has a sprawling lawn, a pool, a spa, and a built-in barbecue in the backyard. 